Hello and welcome to a different type of video. I'm gonna be doing like, this is gonna be like a two part kind of video for me. I'm gonna be filming one part today and one part tomorrow. So today is Tuesday and I normally don't do this until like a Wednesday night or like a Thursday even. Let me just sit down. It's fine. Sorry about all the washing in the back. Today's Tuesday and I'm going to be starting my like weekly routine of when I like tan, wash my hair and everything um, because I've got a really exciting product to feature and everyone loves to feel pampered. I'm sure everyone does. I'm just assuming because um, I do loves to feel pampered and you know feeling their best and at the moment I feel gross. Like I was actually thinking today like my hair should have been washed yesterday my makeup's not sitting right because my skincare is not being done properly so that's what we're going to be doing in this vlog it's 5 16 at the moment and i'm going to have a shower and wash my hair and then um tonight i'm going to epilate my legs <laughs> with my epilator which hurts me every time i do it but because it's coming into summer and i need my legs to be looking as smooth as possible i need to be using this instead of shaving my legs now, this came packaged so beautifully. Um, obviously better than how I'm showing it to you at the moment. But guys, the Udi sent me a robe. So I could choose like any type of product really that they had. And I really wanted like a new luxe robe. So I got this one and it is beautiful. It is like stripy. I'll show you better when it's like on. Um, but for now, it has a hood. It's like insane. And inside is so cozy. Like, I know I said that we're going into summer, but this is like, I'm in Melbourne. So, every day is different, at least for now. Um, and it, like, feels like winter today. So, this is perfect for me tonight. I literally can't wait to get into it. Um, but I'm going to have a shower and everything. And I'll take you into my bathroom. This was just kind of like an intro. And to show off my robe. Hello. Welcome to my bathroom. So I'm gonna have to stand all the way back here, which is probably good, because then you can see more of the robe. Um, but this is the rose striped robe. Um, and it's available in three sizes, S slash X slash M, L slash XL, and O O D. And I got this in the S slash M, and it is the perfect fit. Um, you could definitely wear like stuff under this still as well. Comes with pockets and like, like I said, it's so cozy. Um, uh, and then the outside's so lovely. Also, I obviously have been wearing this around the house before this video, and like cooking with it is so easy because of these sleeves. Usually, like in like jumpers and everything like that, I always get my sleeves dirty because they're so baggy. But these like cuff at the very perfect point. Um, but yeah, I love it. And it's like the best length as well. I don't know if I'll be able to show you in here. Can I? I mean, excuse our dirty bathroom. But it goes up to like a nice length on your legs. Anyway, I really like that type of stuff in my dressing gowns. Um, but the raisin. Oh, and the hood. Which like... Don't think it's meant to look very like sexy, but this is the hood. And it's like a really good size hood as well. So that is my choice of the Udi. And I bought this purely because I love a self-care night. And having something come like this where it's just one thing, you don't have to worry about like, you know, anything else. You can just chuck this on after a shower. Oh, like I literally can't wait to get in the shower and put this back on. But we're going to do my skincare because we're like half of it right now because my skin just hasn't been taken care of. So all I do is literally go in with like a micellar water um, before the shower, take off like my mascara and like the bulk of my face makeup. And then I've got my cleansing oil in the shower. So I'm going to wash my hair and everything today. So I'm going to look really different when I get out of the shower. I'm going to do all that and then I'll do like the after skincare with you guys, like my serums and everything like that. Okay. <laughs> Part one is done. I just took off like the whole base of my makeup and my mascara. Now it's time to get in the shower and wash this hair. Like it's literally probably two days overdue.
God, I did not want to get out of there. All right, so I need to fix his hair. Um, like I said, I did do some cleansing oil in the shower just because it's so much easier than doing it over the sink. And because I was washing my hair anyway, I was getting my face wet, so that's that. So I go in with like any, this is like a smoother spray, but it's like a um, leave-in spray as well. So I literally just spray that everywhere. And then with a wide toothy type of comb, which I literally just got from Woolworths um, and it's changed my life. Like this is such a nice comb. But I obviously dried myself and got straight back in my robe. And the beautiful thing about wearing a robe straight out of the shower is not only are you comfy straight away, when you wash your hair, it doesn't get like all over your back, which I despise. Like I hate feeling like the wet feeling inside my clothes or on my back. So, I mean, it doesn't look any better, but I'm gonna quickly, not quickly, it's probably gonna take me a few minutes. I'm gonna dry this and then we're going to do the rest of my skincare. Okay. I just dried like majority of my hair. I always just make sure that, like the roots are dry and like the underneath is pretty dry. Um, like that part under there. Uh, and then the rest, I just kind of let dry while we're watching TV and I'm making dinner and stuff. Um, and then I like go over it before we go to bed. Like I just put the heat on a little bit more, which is probably bad, but oh well. I don't like to go to bed with like wet hair. And I'm really hoping to grow my hair a bit more before obviously like the wedding, it'll grow. The wedding's not till 2026, but I'm really wanting my hair to be like at least this length. So I'm really trying to keep it healthy um, and not chop it because I'm a cereal like chopper. Let's do the last bit of my skincare for tonight and chuck this back on even though it's not flattering in the slightest um and i use a lot of mecca max products um and i'm nearly out of this toner but i use their exfoliating toner and i'll just go over my whole face just to make sure there are no things like there's nothing that i missed and then I like to pat that in because it is a toner. Um, and then I'm going to go in with this water cooler serum as well. Okay. And then you are sitting on my moisturizer, but I will go in with the Kiehl's moisturizer. But I might not for now. I might just let these sit on my skin and just spray with this rose water spray. And that is this basically done for tonight. I'm going to epilate my legs after dinner. I'm going to start making dinner. And then um, tomorrow is tanning day. I'm going to scrub off this like horrible neck tan tomorrow. Because um, I thought no point like reapplying it tonight. And then like having to try and scrub it off tomorrow. But that's what my skin looks like. I mean, this lighting in the bathroom is like atrocious. But nice and glowy. I do get quite red, especially when like I've just had like a warm shower. Um, but I'm really liking my skin at the moment. I did have like a few breakouts here recently. But I think it's because I've been eating a bit more dairy. So it always kind of happens and they kind of go away. So I'm glad that they're at the going away stage. Hello and welcome back to part two of this video. So, oh, it's now Thursday and it's boiling here in Melbourne, but it's fine. I'm inside now. I can't wait to take all this makeup off. I'm going to do basically the same skincare again as I did yesterday, except I'm going to use um, an exfoliant, which is just the Dermalogica one. 
Um, oh, and a face mask. I'm just going to be using one of these face masks. I'm pretty sure they're just from Makeup. And they're really good. You get like a few in a pack. Um, my best friend's got me this. I think it was when I got my wisdom teeth taken out. And I've still got like three more after this. This one's a mango and grapefruit one. So I'm going to use this. Get into my Udi. No, I'm going to take my makeup off. Get in a shower. I've still got to shave my armpits. And I've got to shave my like, upper leg yesterday after like while I was in the shower. But I airplated my legs last night. It was sore, but it was worth it because they're so smooth. Um, obviously, washed my hair, straightened it a bit today. Um, it's very broken, as you can probably tell. And then I'm going to let my skin breathe for a bit, and then we're going to tan. Okay, I just took basically everything off my face, used the exfoliator, tried to get as much as I could off my neck um, of my tan. I'm going to obviously scrub the rest of it off in the shower. Um, and then we're going to do the rest of my skincare and the face mask. So let's go because I am hungry as well. So I want to start making dinner. Okay. Just got out of the shower and I am needing this face mask on my face. So I'm going to quickly go over my skin with my toner again. Same as yesterday. Just to get that last bit of dirt off. And then like, I always have to end up going back over my neck. I'm going to wait for that to settle down. And now we're going to put on this face mask. And I just look scary in these face masks. So I'm going to put it on and don't judge me. Like, it makes your skin feel so good, but you look so gross. That's what it looks like. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, I'm going to leave this on for a bit and then obviously take it off. And then we're going to turn. So I'm also going to have dinner. Thank you and goodbye. Okay. It is finally time to tan. Um, it got so cold, so I was happy to obviously have this because I'm in, like, shorts and a t-shirt um so i put this on when we were just sitting on the couch as well as a blanket because it got a bit fresh so i'm going to get my mitt and my tan <laughs> looking a bit worse wear um i'm also gonna brush my teeth and I will probs check in tomorrow to show you the actual final result of the 10 because you don't want to see like now. Also have a discount code. So if you want 15% off, type in Bianca Galea 15, all in capitals. Um, I'm not sure if that affects it, but it's all in capitals in my um, email. Bianca Galea 15, I'll pop on screen somewhere and it'll be active for 12 months. So that's fun. Good morning. <laughs> I literally just set the camera up and walk back in. Um, hello, it is now Thursday and I um, marinated in my tan last night. My face like never comes out as dark as the rest of my body, which is fine. So I'm gonna put like a BB cream on before I go to work. Um, so, wanted to show you obviously like the color that it ends up being i think i tanned this hand a bit darker than this hand but that's fine um everything's fine so i mean every time i tan i wake up and put on something comfy um because i'm gonna wash it off anyway so I just kind of lay under around this for a little bit and then get up and then wash the guard layer off so that's what i'm going to do now but i thought this would be a good time to kind of end off the video because that's the end of like my two day type of pampering done plus my battery is about to run out which is perfect timing um but like i said discount code bianca galea 15 i'll have it in the description plus a link to the udi and this robe below and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed if you want to see more videos kind of similar to this let me know I definitely can do that. <laughs> oh, say goodbye.